When you are first learning the clean, get used to holding the bar solidly on the shoulders with the hands closed. Once this position becomes comfortable, and this may take a few workouts, progress to the front squat. After finding your grip, practice the front squat receiving position. This is demonstrated later in this video program in the section, Other Assistance Exercises. Be sure you can comfortably perform the front squat before attempting to learn the following clean techniques. The first stage of learning the clean is to practice a clean pull from the high hang. Begin in the power position with a slight flexing of the lower body and your balance toward the front part of the foot. The bar should be at arm's length, resting at approximately mid-thigh. The arms are straight, elbows over the barbell, your torso is flexed at the waist, with your shoulders over or slightly in front of the bar. Begin the pulling motion by extending your ankles, hips, and knees first, as in a vertical jump. As the jump is completed, the elbows move sharply upward, remaining over the bar as much as possible. The bar will normally reach a position several inches above the navel. Don't hold this extended position, but instead straighten your elbows, lower the bar to the mid-thighs, and let your lower body flex back to the starting position. Next is the full clean from the high hang. Begin with an explosive jump, aggressively pulling your body under the still rising bar. The hips, knees, and ankles are flexed as the body moves under the bar. Bring your elbows quickly in front of the bar while extending the wrists as the bar lands on the deltoids and clavicles. This phase occurs quickly and without hesitation. With practice, you'll learn how to time the rack of the bar before descending into the squat or receiving position. As the bar reaches its final position on the deltoids, the body is 8 to 10 inches into the squat position. Continue to descend to the bottom squat position with the bar in place on your shoulders. Then start the recovery by lifting against the bar while straightening the ankles, knees, and hips until you are standing erect. To lower the bar, flip it off the shoulders and catch it at the top of the thighs, slightly bending the elbows, knees, and ankles. After several workouts of successful cleans from the high hang position, practice the low hang pull. The bar should be just below the kneecaps, with the knees slightly flexed, the torso rigid, and shoulders in front of the bar. Your balance is on the middle of the foot. Keep your arms straight, elbows locked, and directly over the bar. The neck is in a slightly extended position, with the eyes looking straight ahead. The pull from this position begins with a strong hip extension. The bar is raised to about mid-thigh level as your shoulders move straight upward and the ankles, knees, and hips are flexed. Finish the pull as previously practiced. The bar is then returned to the starting position. For the low hang clean, begin in the same starting position. Pull the bar to the power position and explode upward. Pull yourself under the rising bar as you did from the high hang position. Focus on lifting the shoulders and scooping the hips under the bar, then making a big vertical jump, followed by aggressively pulling yourself under the bar. Catch the bar smoothly on your shoulders, then stand. Lower the weight and set up for the next repetition. Now move to the full lift with the barbell on the floor. 
the liftoff begins with the feet flat and the shoulders in front of the bar and the extended elbows over the bar. Inhale deeply before lifting and force the chest up and forward. Your center of balance is toward the front part of the foot. Now extend the knees and hips, pushing the floor away. The rest of the clean is then performed as previously practiced. 